Hi, in this video, you will learn how to sync data between Oracle and Amazon Redshift. In order to use this pre-built pattern, go over to the patterns catalog and select it from the projects folder. The pre-built pattern will be called Oracle Redshift Sync. Once you have selected this pattern, you will be able to use it on the canvas. In order to start using this pattern, you will need to download the last modified JSON zip file, extract it, and upload it on the last modified date snap. In this snap, there will be a file field that you will need to upload. And once you have uploaded the file, go ahead and close the dialog, save, and close. Then move over to the Oracle Select Snap and add an Oracle account or select one that's already available for you to use. Then save and close the dialog. Then move over to the Redshift Bulk Upsert Snap. Add a Redshift account or select one that is also available to you. Save and close the dialog. Now let's go back to the Oracle select snap. And what you want to do now is what we want to do now is label the snap, find the schema name, table name, and also the work clause, save and close. Now let's go over to the Redshift bulk absurd snap. And what we want to do here is also label the snap, fill out the schema name, the table name, and the key columns accordingly, save and close. Once you have done that, go ahead and validate the pipeline. Once it's validated, the pipeline will turn into a light green color, and you can go ahead and execute the pipeline. The pipeline will turn yellow as the data is syncing, and once it's successfully executed, the pipeline will turn green. Now your Oracle data and Redshift data are synced. Thank you for watching this video. For more information, please visit community.snaplogic.com.